Yeah, it's a kestrel. See Can that? Quick. Um, it's recording. See that kestrel? Mm. It flew straight into one of those branches. Had a pigeon. Knocked it straight out onto the ground over there. And then it was trying to kill it. Looks like he's finally done it. Mm. It's phenomenal. Mm. Oh, there it goes. It's just... There you go, it's plucking it now. It's, it's just ripped out its throat to kill it. It's been pinned on the floor for ages. Is it a baby pigeon? No, it's a massive pigeon. Much bigger than the kestrel. If anything, the kestrels are... Well... I don't know when the mating seasons are for birds. Spring, See? He's trying to fly off with it, but he can't quite do it. Looks like it's going to rip its wings off. Nature in the flesh. Mm. Fantastic. He's dead watching it, Yeah, he's watching it from the upstairs window. He's the one who saw it. Mm. Isn't that just fantastic? Mm. See, this kestrel has been very objective. It's ripping out the feathers and anything it can, so we can try and fly off with it. Either that, or it'll just have its meal there and then leave the rest for the scavengers. It's not eating anything at the moment, is it? It's just no, it's still plucking it. We can identify it later. Yeah. Very pale underneath, isn't it? Mm. Yeah. And it's got a distinct stripy tail. Mm. A little bit of red round its head. Right, a sort of pinkish round its neck. Hang on, go get the um, little book on birds. No, let's watch it. Yeah, let's watch it, look at it later. Okay. It's too much, isn't it? Mm. It's a bit heavy for it. Alright, I've only got one minute left on this. <laughs> oh, we should have reduced the... Um, Resolution? Resolution. Nah, it's okay. We just delete some photos because we put them on the uh, computer anyway. Oh, it spotted us. <laughs> Is it zoomed in? Yeah, right in. in front of the bedroom window mm -hmm. and straight into the tree there. Mm. Next thing I know, something falls out of the tree. It's the pigeon. This is what is left. Well, it's quite a lot, actually, of that pigeon that you saw earlier. As you can see, a fair amount of it has actually been plucked. Oh, get a stick and flip it over for me. Oh, I'm holding the camera. No. a head. Look at that. Head's gone. As you can see around here, it's just been completely pecked off. It's really quite clean. And it's been killed there. It's pecked there. Now I wonder if it'll come out later, that sparrowhawk and or kestrel. <laughs> All these feathers. And this is where I did the majority of the plucking.
Now that is a hell of a lot of feathers. No, there's nothing under there. Let's go and examine the body some more. It's gone into rigor mortis already. Yes, you can see it's been plucked very much so. That's just been completely sheared off. That wing is completely decimated. Now that's where all the larger feathers that you saw earlier probably came from. And the tail's still completely there. But the head. No, I am very sorry about the uh, blurriness of the video. This is actually a, just a normal digital photography camera that happens to have a little video function on it. Yes. Now you can see the uh, comparison of the wingspan there. Pretty normal on this side. There is nothing there. And the head, again, completely just shown off. The demonstration, I think, of the Sparrowhawk or Kestrel. I can't tell the difference. It's power. Thank you very much.